What is up everybody? Today we are back on Minecraft PS3 edition and today we are going to be looking at another glitch. Now before you ask, this glitch works on both the Minecraft PS3 edition and Minecraft Xbox 360, so you guys can use it on either console. Now you can see here, obviously this glitch allows you to encase mobs and NPCs in a little trophy case, so you can keep them in your house and look at them and ooh and ah at how pretty they are, or do whatever kind of weird stuff you want to do with the mobs when they're totally subdued. No pun intended. Now, <laughs> to do, go ahead and do this trophy case glitch, what you want to do is you want to take some half slabs and place them in a diamond pattern like so, followed by two glowstone and then four glass on top. So one, two, three, four. Now, the way I'm going to do it right now, I'm going to be trapping a creeper. However, if you want to trap something like an enderman, all you need to simply do is add on one extra piece of glass here. So you want to go five up as opposed to four. However, doing it for a creeper, we are going to go ahead and then take another piece of glass and take it off the side like so. And then we're going to break out this piece of glass and put an upside down piston right there. And then we are going to break out the bottom piece of glowstone and we are going to spawn our creeper right in there. Now that we've done that, we want to go ahead and come up here to the top and we want to place down a redstone torch. And you can see obviously the piston is activated there, pushes the glass on our creeper. And now we have ourselves a little mob trophy case. Now, it's important to note that you need to then go ahead and either keep the half slabs here around the base, or you need to swap it out with some other kind of block. Otherwise, your mob is going to be able to escape from the trophy case that you just built. For whatever reason, they seem to be able to pass through blocks if you do not put this around the base. You can see that firsthand right over here with the zombie. Now, another thing to keep in mind, I'll show you in a minute, but another thing to keep in mind with the zombies is that you need to keep a, a top layer on here. Because if you don't have it, obviously he's going to burn in the sunlight if you have him outside. Now, that's what I was talking about right there. You can see that if you do not have the, uh, the stair piece there, he will be able to escape and obviously come and kill you in your house. Which would be bad. So anyway, I apologize for the little bit of lagginess that I uh, got in this video. I don't think it's any more lag, more or less lag rather than uh, I typically get. It's just, I think, an optimization issue on PS3, unfortunately. So I hope they fix that at some point. Um, but that's just a little side note. This glitch does not lag me any more or less than usual, uh, if you're wondering. So anyway, if you guys enjoyed this tutorial and uh, you have any questions, feel free to drop them down in the comments section and I will do my best to respond to them. Please do drop me a like and if you guys know any glitches that I have not posted on my channel before, feel free to also drop those down in the comments and maybe I'll make a video and give you guys some credit if you show me how to do it. So anyway, with that said, I think that's about it for me. Uh, subscribe for some more Minecraft PS3 and Xbox 360 in the future. And uh, I will see all of you guys in the next video. Peace!